Recently, former First Lady Rosalind Carter uh, passed away. She was the wife of Jimmy Carter, former president. And uh, yesterday was the memorial. Yesterday was the funeral they had for her. And I saw something while I was watching this and learned something that I thought was really important. And I wanted to discuss what that is here today. But before I get into that, I'm Elliot Connie, and I just wanna reintroduce myself. I'm a licensed psychotherapist, and here in the Therapist React series, I talk about things happening in the news and in pop culture so that we could highlight uh, mental health and live better lives individually and in our society. And what I saw was Jimmy Carter, 99 years old, uh, completely devastated uh, that his wife had passed away, understandably so. And um, I learned that they were married for 77 years. And that's so amazing to me and so touching to me. So I wanted to talk about how to have a long-term relationship that lasts and stands the test of time. It's, it's amazing, it's 77 years, wow. I'm gonna tell you a quick story. When I first opened my therapy practice, I wasn't super busy. So I would go into my office in the morning and I might have one or two clients in the morning and then because most people came to therapy after work, I'd have this massive gap in my day. And there was a, a like a town square near my office. So I would drive to that town square and just sit outside. I would get something to eat or maybe, you know, something to drink at a local shop or something. And I would sit by this big kind of majestic fountain in this Times Square. And occasionally there would be this older couple sitting there holding hands, sometimes feeding pigeons, just kind of enjoying life. And they were obviously older to me and they would be doting on one another. And I used to look at them and think how lucky they were to have found each other and or to have found love. I really used to think that. But now after working with thousands of couples and writing books about working with couples and really understanding relationships, now I see they weren't lucky at all. They just worked hard. If you want to have a long-term, long-standing relationship that really can withstand the test of time, it takes work. It takes a lot of work. And the number one thing you have to be willing to do is grow with your partner. And what I mean by that specifically, if Jimmy Carter is 99 years old and they were married for 77 years, that means they got married when he was 22, somewhere around there. And there is no possible way that Jimmy Carter at 22 is the same person he is at 99. And, and in between, there was lots of evolution and lots of growing. Same thing for Rosalind Carter. There's no way she was the same person in her 20s that she was at the time of her passing. Like there's lots of evolving and lots of growing. Your job as a partner is to get to know the new iterations of your partner, fall in love with those new iterations of your partner, and incorporate them into your life. You have to continue wooing your partner because they're always evolving and gaining new parts to themselves. If you wanna have a successful long-term relationship that truly withstands the test of time, that's how you do it. You know, I don't know uh, Jimmy Carter, I didn't know Rosin Carter. But what I, I had that same feeling when I was watching Jimmy Carter at the funeral, same feeling of awe and wonderment when I was back in those early days of my career, looking at those older couples in the park but now I have a little bit more wisdom and understand they earned this by working really hard and evolving together and getting to know the new parts of each other's personality, the new parts of each other's lives, and then incorporating them within themselves. I think sometimes we think like, if you wanna have a relationship last, you have to like buy gifts or you know talk respectfully, don't lie, don't cheat, all that stuff. And all of that is true. I mean, if you wanna have a good relationship, it's for sure. But at the core, if you want a relationship that truly withstands the test of time, you're going to have to understand that the person you married, they're evolving. Like human beings, we're really not human beings, we're human becomings. So you have to get to know your partner as they evolve and as they grow and as they kind of shine and become the new versions of themselves and woo that new version of them and incorporate that into your life and relationship. If you can do that, then you will earn the right to grow old with your partner and celebrate life as it should be. I commend the Carters. Like, this is a life well led, 
a relationship well led and um, it's, it's awesome to watch it. But now I can see it with a little bit more wisdom than what I used to see. And I want all of you to do that same thing. So take heed and make sure if you're in a relationship, you are really, really working to get to know your partner as they grow and evolve and incorporate that into your life. Because if you can do that, your relationship will stand the test of time. Thank you guys for watching. I hope this this made a difference for you. I hope it touched your lives. If so, please leave a comment below. I read each and every comment. I try to reply to each and every comment. And also, please hit that subscribe button and then hit the bell so you get notified. You guys supporting this channel means everything to me. I love you so much for that. So please hit the subscribe button and hit the notification bell so you get notified each and every time we release a video here on this channel and on the Therapist React series, which is every single day, Monday through Friday. Thank you all so much, and I'll see you in the next video.